Hiya, doll face. Come here often? Only on my lunch break. And oh, would you look at the time. It sounds like they ride you hard. <sighs> I don't want to talk about it. Things aren't great right now. What's wrong? Maybe I can help. Thanks, but I don't need any help ruining my life. Are you sure? I'm really pretty good at it. must have been spiked. I can't believe I gave the boss a lap dance at the office party. Why didn't anyone stop me? And more importantly, how do I know what a lap dance is? <laughs> Help you, soldier. I've been on uh, leave. Uh, uh, how's old General Armquist? That loony? Dead. You know, he tried to blow up one of our bases in the 50s. Yeah, uh, I heard that. So, uh, how about that battle over in this? Uh, we, we gave him what for, huh? Yeah, we sure did. 
At times like this, I wish for the good old days. Well, what days would those be? When guys knew their civic duty. The next hippie I catch dodging a draft is gonna spit polish my boots till they shine from inside his ass. Ew. You sound a little tense. Anything I can do? Yeah. Bring a hippie named Clayton Cartwell Jr. into the depot. Happiness is a warm gun. Those hippies refuse to be drafted. If they're not willing to go die young in a foreign country that poses no threat whatsoever to the United States, then what good are they? Right, man? Who'd want to go to war just to line the pockets of the military-industrial complex, man? Clayton's my hero! Sticking it to the man! Good thing he's holding up north of Coit Tower. Buzz never go up there. No! Leave me alone! Capitalist Svolich, you will not be drafting small hippie man. Baby. Dude, kid. Who the hell? 
The Lord of the Sacred Crutch. How are the parties going? Uh, finally feeling part of our little cult family. The police have been riding our asses. This one cop, Officer Rudolf Malletmeister, he is harassing the hell out of us. What do those pigs have against pacifists anyway? A chance to wail on some cops? Count me in, Tiger. Right on! If even one of our tents is saved, we will be able to rebuild! You clone tents? Uh, never mind. Uh, let's go pack some pigs! for the Democratic Convention.
this. We're saved! If I ever see that little green dude again, he's gonna... Lord of the Sacred Grudge. How's the cult going, Shammy? New converts by the bushel. Membership has been falling off, son of Argvudr. Perhaps you could give us a hand. Sure, like I got nothing better to do. We are needing you to advertise in a very big way. What's with the drop in converts? You skimping on the free love again? It is not my fault. No, word only travels so fast. We need to advertise. How's it going with the research on the super weapon, Chammy? If you're looking very hard for clues, please, you will just have to trust me. See, uh, that's where we have a problem. We may have found something, but it has yet to arrive. I will have more to speak of this soon, Sacred Son. What kind of big way? And why do I think I'm not gonna like it? Use your holy saucer! Pick up a cult member, fly him around the streets! And get shot at by every grunt in Bay City? Why don't I just go chew on a grenade? It's only a few tanks, nothing to worry about. People will think it's fireworks. But you cannot fire back, you cannot risk hitting potential converts. Why am I not surprised, damn pacifists? Please do go to your saucer and select a cult member. Good luck, Sacred Son. Who is it? Uh, now see, that's just wrong. Better get Low from the boodle, righteous brother! I hope this plan of yours is better than it sounds. It's gonna be groovy, man. Pick me up in your laser beam and let's fly! What, so you can throw up on pedestrians? Great idea, Sparky. Have a cookie. No! I'll shout the good pickup line of Ark Boodle. It's gonna be far out! Oh, right. Why didn't I think of that? The things we do for love. How'd you come, Dark Voodle? Not that I care, but I like to pretend. My dad's been giving me a hard time. He cut off my allowance. So I decided to get back at him the best way I know how. Organize religion, baby. That makes a scary kind of sense. What's the buzz, baby? Helter Skelter! Helter Skelter! Holy Inquirer!
Ooh, 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 pick me, pick me! Over here, dude!
You tried the rest. Now try the blast. Arc boodle, arc boodle. Woo! Yeah, what do you want? Whoa, man. Lay off the caffeine, pal. You look a little wired. I am just so mad about the heat I'm getting over that raid on the hippies' tents in the park. Oh, that was you. Yeah, yeah, that was some uh, serious hippie smackdown, all right? Just what we had to do. Excessive force. What the hell does that mean, anyway? I mean, hey, you want him out of the park or not, am I right? Sounds like you could use a little pick-me-up, Rudy, my man. What I need is for the snitch who ratted me out to disappear. He's been driven to a hotel between Hashbury and Coit Tower. He'll be guarded, but when he gets out of the car... I hear ya. Hippie Pate, coming right up. Hey, thanks, brother. I won't forget it. Hey, we cops. We gotta stick together, right?
What were they thinking? Attacking hippies in broad daylight. Any idiot knows you've got to do that stuff at night if you want to get away with it. Well, discipline never hurt anyone. Hey, I spent five years in the army and it gave me courage and character. And the clap. But it was worth it! Name. He's gonna be sorry he ever tried to wail on us. Don't let me die! I don't want to die! I don't want to be a martyr! You're ah. gonna be famous if you're dead! Somebody okay up there! Life. Hey, city police! Protect the hippie dirtbag! I am so stoned! Hold it right there, pal. Can I help you? Don't move! Everything's under control! Save the stinking snitch! Things worse! You throw like a girl! You just crossed the thin blue line! <gasps> Protect the hand of the thin Save the stinking snitch! What is it, soldier? Yo, Sarge, uh, what's happening? Zip it, soldier, we got problems. Private Danz has been caught selling bazookas to the Soviets. Also, he may have some photos. I was young and needed the money. Anyway, I want him dishonorably discharged, get me? You want me to kill one of your own guys? He's a security risk, yeah, that's it. You got a problem with that, soldier? Me? Nah. Good. Feel free to use him as a meat shield or, you know, whatever.
Those documents you recovered in Bay City were most informative. It seems the Soviet spy master, Agent Orinchov, is at large somewhere in this very city. Well, he ain't here for the weather, that's for damn sure. So, those documents say where I might find our little buddy Orinchov? According to the documents, he's established a secret base somewhere underground. Yeah, I bet he's big into underground movements. <laughs> oh, you're good. That was very good. Have you ever thought about doing stand-up? Pay attention! Secret base underground. Well, that shouldn't be too tough. Just scan the city while we were flying in. Yes, but it's useless. This city is riddled with tunnels, pipes, and excavations galore. It's like a damp, moldy sponge built atop a noxious Swiss cheese. Vivid. So what do we do? I suppose you'll have to swallow your pride and ask one of the natives. Aw, oh, not again. I hate reading human minds. They're so simplistic. Like reading a pop-up book. Okay. Locate the tunnels, infiltrate them, and find Agent Orinchov. Then squeeze. Hard. Indeed. Happy spelunking!
country gets that East Hyde Park tunnel filled in, the better. Roads, ruffians, scallywags. The place is a magnet for undesirables of every kind. Hyacinth and the biddies at the bridge club think if they saw me sneaking off to those tunnel happenings. Oh, it's all happening. This looks like the entrance to their subterranean <laughs> stair, all right? Get in there and people. start spilling. I must sample it. I am KGB agent. Who is there? What? I am oh. 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 I'm choosing life. <laughs> Infamous Agent Orange job. Look, Ivan, I'm kinda in a hurry, and between you and me, I'd just as soon save the ammo. So what do you say we skip the Kalinka dance and you tell me what I wanna know? You got another thing coming.
Chicken Kiev. What the hell was in those cans? Revelade can't do that. Well done, Mr. President. Well done indeed. Do I know you, teabag? No, sir, but I know you. Forgive me, it seemed best simply to stand clear and give you room to do what you do so well. These Soviets are rather slippery fish. Yes, very slippery indeed, but they do crack. If you'll follow me, Mr. President, I can promise you answers in abundance, shall we?
I wonder if we might have a little chat now, Mr. President. Yeah, sure. What the... Hey, wait a second, Mr. President. I ain't in my presidential disguise. How do you know who I am? They don't call it British intelligence for nothing, old boy. Okay, you got my attention. Who the hell are you? Reginald Ponsonby Smythe, at your service. And Her Majesty's, although in her case, the service is secret. I'm with M16, the Foreign Intelligence Agency. What's with the suit? Somebody die? In this line of work, somebody always does. Besides, just because I'm a civil servant doesn't mean I have to dress like one, eh? Aren't you a little overdressed? As Oscar Wilde once said, one should either be a work of art or wear a work of art. And this suit is exquisite, don't you think? If you say so, I'm uh, more the wash and wear mylar type. Okay, so I I'm starting to get a little ticked off here. Th these bastards blow up my mothership, kill my boss, screw up my pension plan, and just when I track one of them down, he turns into some kind of super-powered freakazoid mozzarella monster. I sympathize. To be frank, sir, we appear to be fighting a common enemy. Might it not be the better part of valor to join forces and pool our information? Hmm. Ah, I seem to be late for a previous engagement. It's been a pleasure, Mr. Cryptosporidium. Do feel free to drop by at your leisure. I think you'll find we have some mutual interests. But... Excellent, excellent. I'll expect you for lunch, then. Splendid. Must dash. <laughs> <laughs>